In exciting tech news today, one local cattle rancher is making a big splash in the area of vegetarian meat substitutes. You'll be utterly amazed. You know, because of the udders on the... Steve has a story. Thanks, Cliff. I'm standing here with Shank Whittles, owner and proprietor of Whittles Cattle Farm, and he says that he's come up with an ingenious new way of turning plants into meat just by feeding them to cows. Shank? Yeah, I love beef. Ever since I was in diapers, I've been eating beef. Jerky, patty, stroganoff, you name it. The thing is, there's this whole market out there of these uh, veggie, ve vegans. Oh, veg uh, vegetarians. Vegemanarians, yeah. yeah, those people. So we're missing out on a whole bunch of sales. But this new process we've come up with actually turns plants into meat. You will never know the difference. The company claims that this process is 100% organic and all natural, and that the end product isn't absolutely disgusting like most other vegetarian meat substitutes. According to researchers, most vegetarian and meat substitutes are typically revolting and disgusting because they're made of vegetables, which no one likes because they're yucky and gross. This process seems to circumvent all those problems and creates a product that is indistinguishable from a delicious, juicy hamburger patty. So basically, this new process takes the plants, slowly processes them through an advanced new system that we don't even fully understand yet, and then after two, three years, you have delicious steaks. So yeah, that's uh, pretty much it. Are you working with some dangerous sciencey chemicals there? Oh uh, no, this? This is just straight vodka. <sighs> it's five o'clock somewhere. So this is made completely of plants that were converted into meat just by feeding them to cows. That's right and I guarantee you won't be able to taste the difference. All right. That's amazing. That tastes just like meat. If you want to pick up your own plant-based meat patty, you need to get on down to your local grocery store or fast food joint. And you know what? Shank says that they're going fast, so you better get a move on. <laughs> so because of the cows. Moo? Nah, never mind. Back to you, Cliff. Coming up next, we take a look at a new study that has found that avoiding red meat may lead to a longer, more miserable life. I'm Cliff! Oh, utterly. I just, I just got that because of the, because of the, because uh, the udders, because cows, they have udders. Imitation is the highest form of flattery, said no one ever who's ever tried a meat alternative. Ever. That's why Good Ranchers isn't in the meat alternative business. They're in the business of sourcing the best real meat and seafood in America and shipping it to your door. Head on over and get boxes of delicious meat for you and every one of your friends. You can give them the hottest new technology in meat and get $35 off your order at goodranchers.com slash Babylon Beef. Good Ranchers, innovative, delicious American meat delivered.